You have entered the plumbing business success zone, teaching entrepreneurs the business of plumbing. This is Potty Talk Live, recorded live on Facebook every week. And now your host, Richard Bainey, the million dollar plumber. Guys, was this proactiveness, so awesome. okay? This, this proactiveness, mm-hmm. you just um, with all the fear and the stuff that was happening, mm-hmm. it, um, you, know, you know, I'm just gonna put it in my own words. Larry, I didn't hear you go, you know, oh my Lord, you know what, oh, you know, things are gonna go crazy, what's gonna happen, what are we gonna do? Mm-hmm. What he did is he went and got the mask, I mean, even whether you agree or disagree, does, like, you do it for the business. You know this mm-hmm. is coming. Okay, I'm, I'm going to get. I'm going to get there before everyone else gets there. Get all the stuff and prep my guys. Okay, right. and be ready for whatever. Whatever hits the fan. Mm-hmm. All right, we got to be ready. And so there's this it's attitude it's of adapting. Adapting. Right. Mm-hmm. We're I'm, we're going to take the hill mm-hmm. no matter what. We're going right. to take the hill. Mm-hmm. You know, and I and I love it. And and Larry, that's the key that I see see with um, uh, certainly with uh, the ones that my clients, I, you know, private clients that we work more closely with. Uh, the ones that are having the record, you know, the record weeks and record month um, are have that attitude of just, I'm, I'm going through. I'm mm-hmm. just, we're going to keep moving Pushing forward. Through. And the ones that are kind of struggling a little bit, maybe got caught up in the fear. Mm-hmm. Um, and so when things did come down and all, everything's kind of scary, they kind of got a little scared too. Mm-hmm. They let, let the fear get the best of them a little bit. Right. Is that, do you, you feel that's maybe what happened or what's your, your take on that? Yeah, hundred percent. Um, you know, when I think when, when things happen, most, most people, you know, kind of, um, they react instead of being mm-hmm. proactive. Mm-hmm. So like, as I kind of look at, you know, what's going on in the environment in general. If I see something like I instantly went to work and it was like, head down, this is where we're going. I don't, I don't care what's, you know, what's being said on the news. I mean, and I don't even watch the news, right. but I started watching the news uh, on both sides, you know, the mm-hmm. different networks, different, you know, agendas, whatever, just to see what the people were being told so I can be proactive on how I'm going to approach things. Mm-hmm. So it, uh, I was driving Jody absolutely crazy. She's oh, like, yeah. could you just watch <laughs> turn it off? Because right. <laughs> we, don't, we don't watch the news, you know, I just don't mm-hmm. in general, you know, just a just depressing so yep, right. um, but, uh, so we uh, we just got really proactive and and that was it you know it, it kind of go like what we were talking about the other day it's like you know you you can learn things or educate yourself and just freeze you know paralysis right. by analysis right exactly. right so freeze up and do nothing and just say you know what I'm gonna wait it out and see what happens a lot of people did that some people mm-hmm. just closed their doors like all together mm-hmm. and said i'm not going anywhere and it's like i think you could put some things in in uh, into play mm-hmm. um i think brian kind of hit that microphone or that brian, camera but the camera yeah, i see i tell you brian he's trouble he's trying to be all artsy yeah. is what he's doing right right yeah i don't even know what where i was at are we good okay no um, um, well uh, Oh, go ahead, yeah, where, where people, you know, you got it when things hit. And it, that, I think this is a good business mm-hmm. lesson because these kind of economic things, it, certainly this is, um, um, it's very possible that this is probably the worst, um, certainly um, a health kind of crisis and an extreme in my lifetime that I've experienced. No but but it, was, it was extreme Jessica. in 2000. It was extreme in 2008 and 9. You know, things happen in business. Mm-hmm. And so to be successful with your plumbing business, you got to adapt with these things and look at it. OK, how, how can I make opportunity out of this? What, what can I do um, to, to, you know, to, to work through this, around this, under it, over it? What, mm-hmm. you know, what do I got to do to keep moving forward um, instead of letting um, the fear, the, the fear.